I'm very glad that the Dylan Mulvaney, whatever, like 15 minutes of fame, five minutes of fame. I'm very glad the 15 minutes of fame for Dylan Mulvaney is over. Right? Bud Light supported him and that blew up in their face and made them lose a lot of customers and all of that nonsense. I never got too into that. I've just heard of that. Dylan Mulvaney, if you're unaware, is a man that surgically altered himself and grew his hair long and puts on makeup and wears a, or, you know, holds a, a pride of sin flag. Dylan Mulvaney is a man. Nothing will change that. That is not hate speech. That is reality. And for people that love science so much, that is also science. His DNA is a man. Nothing can change that. Absolutely nothing can change that. Not makeup, not surgery, not hormones, etc. Waving a little pride flag. Nothing changes the fact that this is a man. Oh, here's Dylan Mulvaney looking very natural, like a natural woman with bandages from head to lips to everything. This is horrifying. This is absolutely horrifying. There are cases of people, many people that have done something like this and then a little time goes by and they severely regret it because this is not natural at all. This here is not natural at all. It's, it's very sick. It's very perverted. It's very wrong. That's what it is. Well, this is so attractive. A very skinny man wearing a woman's bikini. Like, honestly, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn the page very soon. But honestly, see this for a second? N no, thank you. Th this is absolutely horrifying. This is not a woman. This is a man that is lying to himself. Okay, like, this is a man with some long hair and lipstick on, and he's pulling out a tampon. You know, for the menstrual period, when, when women have a period, that, that is for women. This man will never have a period. I don't know why, like, again, I kinda do know why a bit too, like, I don't think this person is that serious about this. I think they just wanted their 15 minutes of fame. So they did something extreme and they went into the media and got sponsored and that all backfired and I'm very glad it backfired on him. Come on here. Hey, like, if people defend this, if people actually defend this man pulling out a tampon, they need some serious help. They have horrible discernment. They don't know what's what. They don't know what's up or down. They need to like check themselves before they wreck themselves. <laughs> Dylan Mulvaney is a man. He will always be a man. No matter what he alters himself to be. This is a man that's pulling out a tampon. I will stop saying that now and end the video. But this is ridiculous that this is the world we live in. Sodom and Gomorrah much? Days of Noah and Lot much? Brothers and sisters, everyone else, God bless you.